everybody, welcome back to Prissy Beauty. Today I have another tutorial for you. Um, sort of fall inspired, so it's like a very pretty defined look using like a, a dark green. And for this look I'm using the um, the Balm Rock Rockstar palette and I'm using pretty much um, like, you know, browns and a dark, dark um, green, which I think it's beautiful, especially if you have uh, brown eyes, I think it really emphasizes your eyes. So if you like this look and you'd see how I did, stay tuned. Okay, so as I usually do, I start with the base for my eyeshadow. And again, I'm gonna use a Maybelline color tattoo. I love this stuff. It's definitely one of my favorite drugstore products. Um, I'm using this one is in the shade um, Mossy Green. I believe this was a limited edition last year for fall. It came out with some, I don't know if it's out again. Hopefully this fall will come out again. But it's beautiful. It's like this hunter, not hunter green, but like this, I don't know, army green, whatever it is. It's beautiful. I love it. Uh, I'm applying with my fingers and I'm leaving the inner corner alone because we're going to apply a different shade in there as usual um, just to highlight the inner corner so I'm going to leave that alone and I'm going to be using the shade Led Zeppelin from the uh, Rockstar palette from but the By the Bomb which really matches this, uh, sh this color tattoo and I love that shade I love this kind of green I think it's very pretty so with the shading brush, I'm just going to take some of that and apply right on top of the collar tattoo. And it only makes it a little darker, but it's a very similar color to the collar tattoo. So it's beautiful. All the shades I'm using is from this palette, but you can easily find in some other palettes you have, so no reason to panic. Okay, now with the, with the um, blending brush, I'm just going to lightly brush or blend the, the edge here, just doesn't look harsh. And then with the same brush, I'm going to go into the shade Allegro, which is like a, a mid-tone brown, which is perfect for the crease, like Buck from the Naked palette. And this goes on the crease, and this is going to be my transition color. And I'm going to use to blend this out. Very simple, pretty look. I love these colors. I think they go together very well. So blend it all the way. Then with a little angle brush, I'm going to go into the shade Adagio. Adagio. Which is, for me, it's like a brow bone shade matte, which I love. Okie dokie. With a pointy brush like this, I'm going to go in the shade Presto, which is a very dark brown. And this is going to be my outer V color. Bring it up a little bit in the, to the crease, nothing too high. Bring it down if you want. And all this shade always fall out. So the last I do is my concealer so I can erase all of that. Okay, with a pencil brush I'm going to go into the shade Iron Maiden, <laughs> which is a golden shade. And this is going to be on the inner third and the inner corner here. Bringing that in and down if you like. With the with this flat brush by Sigma, I don't know, I don't usually use it. It's called Flat Definer. It's E15. I'm gonna go oops into the Presto shade and run that down the lower lash line, like I do in every tutorial. Looks like. And going back into the green one, the Led Zeppelin one, and doing it again. 
Led Zeppelin, which is the green shade, has a little bit of shimmer, shimmer so it's pretty. Okay, I'm going to be using this um, eyeliner by NYX in the shade... Where is it? Golden Olive. It's one of those glide on, stay on, super long on name. I'm going to use that on, in the uh, waterline. It's dark enough, but it's not black, so it, it gives a little bit soft. It has a little bit of sh like um, sheen to it. And then I'm going to run that on the lower lash line. Such a pretty pencil. Like so. And then with a black liner, I'm going to line the top very close to the lash line. And then with a smudgy brush, I'm gonna smudge out the uh, the top. I just really want to darken the lash line, nothing else. Now, you can go back in and reinforce that little golden shade in the inner corner because for me it doesn't look that's there anymore after I did all my other things. So I go back in there, apply that. And if you want to reinforce the green a little bit more, go back on the Led Zeppelin and apply that on top. And that's pretty much it. Now put mascara on. Curl my lashes. Little bit of mascara. Top and bottom. And then lastly, concealer under the eye just to clean up everything that might have fallen down there. And you always help. And this is it for the end. Thank you so much everybody for watching this tutorial. If you like, give me a thumbs up. And if you have questions, leave me comments below. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave. And um, for a complete list of all the products I use for my face, check the down bar, okay? Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you next time. Bye.